Greetings, Dark Souls 2 Goru here, and welcome to the secrets of Brightstone Cove. From the first bonfire in the tent, make your way towards the well and up the hill, jumping into it to pick up three holy water urns. Down the tunnel is a chest with five human effigy. Make your way through the level until you come to the room full of spiders. In the next room is the mist door, and beside it is a secret wall with an Esther's flash shard inside. After beating the boss in the next room, head outside and climb the ladder on the left to find Cromwell and a bunch of items lying around including a skeptic spice, bonfire ascetic, and a fading soul. From the next bonfire, drop down into this room and you'll find the two NPCs fighting. You can pick which one to side with. Also in this room is a hidden passage behind a bookcase. You will receive a key and other items from the person that you side with in the duel. Following the hidden passage behind the bookcase will lead you to this room with a hidden lever behind the boxes. Pulling it allows you to jump to a chest for a southern ritual ring. Head back outside and drop down into the sand pit, and you will come to this door that says it's too heavy to open. You can smash it open, but be careful as you will take damage. Inside, you can use the key that you got from the winner of the duel to open two chests. One is trapped, so be careful, but inside is ten rusted coins and engraved gauntlets in the other. Around the back of the quicksand hole are double doors with a chest hidden behind a bookcase. Inside is a crescent axe and a soul vortex spell. Once you've defeated the boss in this level and beaten Lord Seldora in the next room, you will receive a key for the locked door in the location with all the spiders dropping down from the ceiling. Inside is a chest with the Black Knight Ultra Great Sword, a Fire Seed, and the Great Fireball Spell. Just be careful for the spiders that try and sneak up on you when you enter the room. You can also return to the Scorpion NPC in the Shaded Woods after beating the boss, and he will give you the second Dragon Ring, which raises your HP, Stamina, and Resistances. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and don't forget to watch the Throthgar Rage playthrough. Heal me! No! Oh! A frogoid! Get back! Oh! Overwhelm me! There's more. What the? They overwhelm with their hideousness. Poison again! Oh, the door's open. Gotta make it! Oh, the poison's choking me!